TCU over Liberty here in Kansas City, the Hall of Fame Classic. We've seen it over the last week. The towel draped over the shoulder in honor of the late John Thompson III, who was known for that, who did so much on the court and off the court. He's Mark Adams. I'm Chucky Kemp. You've got a towel of your own here with a special story. Tell us about it. Yeah, John Thompson Jr., he wore this towel over his right shoulder to honor his mother. She wore the towel over her shoulder when she was cooking in the kitchen. You know, one thing I've learned throughout this process over the last several difficult months, I asked Kelvin Sampson, Kelvin, at times I feel very uncomfortable. And at times I don't know what to say, what to do, what to ask. He said, Mark, listen and communicate. And so this week when I read that the black coaches united would wear these towels over their shoulder, I wondered if maybe it wasn't appropriate for me to do it. And so what I did was I reached out to John Thompson III. And John Thompson III was very gracious in his time. He explained to me that his father would be more than supportive of me bringing this towel to Kansas City and wearing it over my shoulder, just like you see with Richie McKay there. This towel also has even greater significance to the story of John Thompson because in 1985, this towel is the towel I brought to Kansas City with my Rocky Mountain College team to the NAI National Tournament. And at that tournament, I met the legend John McClendon who was a civil rights leader in his own right, was the first black head basketball coach of a professional franchise in the Cleveland Pipers. He won three consecutive NAI national tournaments in 57, 58, and 59. And I met the legend right here in Kansas City as I had this towel draped over my shoulder in Old Kemper Arena. You know, John Thompson did a lot for this game, and his mentor, John McClendon, did as well. And here we sit in the historic city of Kansas City, honoring the memory of John Thompson, Jr., and also John McClendon, who I had the pleasure of meeting right here.